Have you ever caught yourself thinking, I'm definitely better at this than most people? Whether it's driving, working, or just being a decent human being, we all do it. But what if I told you that this common thought is actually a psychological trap? Welcome to the world of illusory superiority bias, where our brains trick us into thinking we're better than average. Intrigued? Let's dive in. So, what exactly is the illusory superiority bias? In simple terms, it's our tendency to overestimate our own abilities compared to others. Basically, we think we're better than average, even when we're not. Ever felt like you're the best driver on the road, even though everyone around you seems to be an idiot? Yep, that's the illusory superiority bias at work. Let's kick things off with a classic example, driving. Studies have shown that most people rate themselves as above average drivers. In fact, a study conducted by the University of Nebraska found that 93% of American drivers consider themselves to be better than the average driver. Now, mathematically speaking, that's impossible. If most people are above average, then the average itself would have to shift. But this bias makes us believe that we're better than most, even when we might just be average. And it's not just driving. This bias creeps into all areas of life. Think about your workplace. How often have you thought you're doing a much better job than your colleagues? Or remember those group projects back in school? Ever felt like you were the one carrying the team? While it's true sometimes, the illusory superiority bias often makes us overlook our own shortcomings and amplify the flaws in others. But why do we have this bias? Well, part of it is about self-esteem. We all want to feel good about ourselves and believing we're better than average boosts our confidence. It's a protective mechanism. However, it can also lead to some pretty significant blind spots. If we think we're already excellent, we might not see the need to improve or learn. Let's bring in another real-life example, health. A study from the Harvard School of Public Health found that a significant portion of people rated their health as better than others, even when they had the same health conditions. This overconfidence can lead to neglecting important health advice or not seeking medical help when necessary because we think we're invincible. The illusory superiority bias doesn't stop at personal abilities or health. It extends to moral judgments too. People often believe they are more ethical and moral than others. A survey published in the journal Social Psychological and Personality Science revealed that most people rated themselves as more moral than the average person. Yet when it comes to actions and decisions, we all fall short sometimes. This bias can prevent us from acknowledging our own mistakes and learning from them. Now, let's talk about the dangers of this bias. When we're blinded by our own perceived superiority, it can lead to complacency. In the workplace, for instance, overestimating our abilities might result in not putting in the necessary effort to grow and improve. In relationships, it can make us less empathetic, as we might not appreciate the strengths and contributions of others. Think about teamwork. If everyone in a team believes they're the best and their way is the only right way, collaboration becomes challenging. It can lead to conflicts, poor decision-making, and ultimately, failure to achieve common goals. A study by Stanford University highlighted that teams with members who believed they were superior had less cohesion and were less productive. So, how can we combat the illusory superiority bias? The first step is awareness. Recognizing that this bias exists can help us catch ourselves when we start to overestimate our abilities. Next, seek feedback. Honest feedback from peers, mentors, or even through self-assessment tools can provide a reality check. Embrace a growth mindset. Understand that there's always room for improvement, no matter how good you think you are. Finally, cultivate empathy. By appreciating and recognizing the strengths and abilities of others, we can balance our self-assessment and foster better collaboration and relationships. In conclusion, while it's natural to think highly of ourselves, it's essential to stay grounded. The illusory superiority bias can cloud our judgment and hinder personal growth. By being aware of it, seeking feedback, and valuing others, we can achieve a more balanced and realistic view of our abilities. Thanks for watching. If you found this video insightful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more intriguing dives into the human mind. Stay curious and keep learning.